It's fairly loud in my ears. Let's turn that down. <clears throat> As we return to Tremble Valley. I almost forgot we have basically a standing mission now to go take out those plague walls or something. We have six of those. Six of those, um... Not bunker busters, what are they called? Wall busters? Plague busters? I wonder if we should be grabbing those and hoping that's enough. Or if we need to, um... You know, wait till we find another... Another bloater laying on the ground to get its gland because there were three at that location that we were sent to one of them got away because we pressed Y to get its gland and ended up searching a box beside it instead <laughs> but in the absence of anything right, else to do right now you have all the knowledge you need to take on the gauntlet of plague wolves in Marshall I recommend stocking up on Plague Busters and plenty of cure before you start your assault. You'll have time to rest and resupply between each assault. Good luck to you. I will. Alright. Well, maybe we can go ahead and start then. Um, not with this dude, because he's already very slightly plugged up. But with, um... The other gentleman. Let's just switch to him now. Chavez, right? He's decent at fighting. He's not as good as you'd think he would be, being a red talent dude. Much better than Isby. We haven't used his weapon smithing once. Nonetheless, I was thinking Chavez was our dude. Let's let Chavez be our dude. Jumped off the top. We haven't been him in a long time either. Our main dude hasn't seen any action in a long time. All right, uh, let's grab you these. Are, the, are these them? Am I making this up? Is this them? Uh, that's the only thing I see that looks like it. It's a pursuit mine. Is that a plague buster? That's not a plague buster. Are these them? That's what we want. Not these other fucking things. Where did you go? Oh, I got six of them in one slot. Right. Let's take both of these, because you never know. Thank you. And let's grab a companion. Who are we going to grab? Someone who's not so. Maybe Quincy himself. Maybe the man himself. How's she doing? She's pretty good at fighting. Maybe we'll be her. Or grab her. To come along with us. Where's Helena? I do wish you could ask them to join you via the menu there. When, you, when you're in... In your own home here. Like, I shouldn't have to go searching all over the base. There's no way to do that, is there? No. It'd be nice if, if when this popped up, there was like a press Y to ask them to join you. We communicate via radio. Why can't I just call her and be like, hey, yo, come join me? It's hard to remember folks we've lost, but it's what keeps us human. Definitely not Isby, she's not very good at fighting at all. On her best day, let alone right now, when she hasn't had any training. Lady, where are you? Are you on the roof? You're on the fucking roof, aren't you? For unknown reasons. Oh, come on. Is this you? Before I get all the way up? She's listed as right here. Someone's listed as right here. I'm standing on them now. This is just cool. <laughs> I don't want to risk dying by falling off that. But it's cool. She's not on the roof. Right? The fuck? Where are you? Is that her? This is Isby again, isn't it? Oh crap, I just now got it. Dinosaurs, oil, gas station. Duh. What can I do for you? I didn't get that before either. Thank you. Atlanta. Can you some I legitimately help real quick? never thought of that. I'm right behind you. Well, maybe I did. Maybe I did. Bronto gas. I guess I did in the past. I didn't associate it with Jurassic Junction per se. 
I don't think I linked. I don't think I linked Jurassic Junction and Bronto Gas, but I did think the Bronto Gas stations. Are right, we gonna go? I assume you have a decent weapon. I don't remember. Uh, before we go, sorry, hon. That's no excuse to start getting lazy. Let's grab one more. I'm gonna get lazy, Quincy. Can't stop me. Alright, coffee is in the mouth. Now in the throat, now in the belly. Let's go. Stay down, Ben. You're welcome to come over here if you want. Come on. Alright, we are going this way for sure. Grab a seat, Ben. Honey, yes, come here. Sorry, my cat is wandering in front of the television. Heedless of the fact that I'm careening down a highway with pop-in zombies in front of me. Potential pop-in zombies. I'll admit, hey, one of the things that excites me... Well, one of the things that excites me most about a State of Decay 3, beyond just having more State of Decay content, etc., is, um... I think they're going with Unreal Engine this time, so it should eliminate the poppin' we've been seeing. Alright. I'd say these defenses are as good as they can get. Let's hope we don't have to test Glad to hear it. There's at least two other characters in this game that are recruitable that we've not yet recruited, either because we fucked up the mission and didn't. Or or because the mission hasn't come up yet. I'm hoping the latter. I learned that when I saw a uh, you know a close achievement that pops up on your Xbox screen saying we have seventy five percent of the survivors recruited and we've recruited six. I've I've gone too far. Stupidly. Ah, let's keep going. We're going this way. Anias, please get down. You are literally causing me to hit cars. Thank you. It's cool to recognize all this from, like, State of Decay. This area especially, since I spent so much time here over the years in Breakdown. Or over the months in Breakdown when I played or whatever. Definitely took the wrong way. The scenic route is... Although I'm still baffled by the quantity of cars that are here for no reason. Like, I, they, they weren't... They weren't abandoned here during the apocalypse. Or, or preceding the apocalypse. It wasn't people trying to escape who ram vehicles into this location. This is... For fuck's sakes. This is assholes after the apocalypse doing this. I don't know why. After our people left Trumbull, somebody drove all those cars out there and then smashed them apart. It must have been drivable unless they were towed. So they weren't in that bad of shape. Strange. Lots of infestations we could, in theory, take out. Obviously, that's not our goal right now. Alright, we're approaching whatever the fuck the gauntlet is. Do I just... Do I just chuck Plague Busters at it? What do I do? Is that what I'm doing? I gotta stay out of that guessing? Cloud. If I'm wrong, I'm wasting this shit. Is that working? Okay. That didn't work. Plague wall coming up. You'll be fine. 
That accomplished nothing. I did. Damn it. Too slow. I'm gonna lose her. For no fucking reason. Stay out of that fucking plague wall area. He's not doing anything. That's doing nothing. What the fuck is with this? I didn't bring enough ammo for this. That's it, I'm empty. That was useful. Back up now! Girl, let's go. Damn it. Too slow. Elena, come on. Grab it. I'm done. Try it one more time. Got to throw it directly at that bubble. That fucking thing. Is that working? I know it felt that. Maybe. It's not doing much. She's shooting it? Is that, is that what's happening? Yes. It's not doing anything. All that's happening is that she's shooting it. Fuck it. Back up now! Gotta move faster next time. Am I lecturing her? Tell me she's gotta move faster. Keep shooting the fucking wall. Am I even hurting this thing? No, no. That's my last shot. Great. Come shoot this fucking wall, girl. Come here, come here, come here. Too slow. We're gonna have to come back. Let's get out of here for now. Come on. Helena? Helena, fucking come on. Helena, you dumbass. Shit. Now say come I need to get through that wall. So I'm thinking, oh, Jesus Christ, Helena, where did you fucking go? You're gonna die. Let's go. We're leaving now. I bet you want another plague buster, huh? Helena, come on. All right, we are gone. We did not succeed, <laughs> nor shall we. Anytime soon. Let's go make, um... Oh, Jesus Christ, come on. Let's go make a goddamn outpost of some sort. Let's get somewhere pseudo-safe. There's a fucking horde coming. This is not even mildly safe. This isn't even jokingly pseudo-safe. Alright, nothing's approaching us for the moment. Let's just sit here for a second. Look at our map. What do we need? We're losing five food per day. We need another food outpost. So let's find one around here. Boyle's Pet Store? That ain't it. Lots of nice medicine places. 
Club shows are all bullshit when you look at the details. The procedure, the way they interrogate, handling evidence. I love them because of what they do get right. Saving people, getting the bad guys. It's why you become a cop. You've got a feral over there. Yeah, I know. I think we went the wrong way. McDermott's is back that way. Um, yeah, I found that frustrating because they did not they did not explain in the least what a plague buster does. As if I'm even intuiting it right now. You throw the plague buster, and while the plague buster is active, you can hurt the plague wall. But when it's not active, you can't. I, they did not even distantly explain that. Maybe you're supposed to intuit it. Maybe you're supposed to figure it out as you go, and that's part of the process. I don't know. But I found it frustrating. Oh, damn it, Helena. Let's go. Surprise me. Yo, keep it together. I don't know how badly hurt she is either. She might be plagued up for all I know. Shit, there's some nearby. Better stay quiet. Okay. What can I do Let me for take you? a look at her. 66%. We're going to get both of us out of here. Where do we make this a home base thing? -er? Where does one do this? Right here. Claim this out. Fuck me. Look at what's coming. Secure, drop to your knees. I don't mean that in a dirty way. Just drop to your fucking knees. Alright, we have this place. Let's fucking search. Oh, it is one of my favorites. Thank you. I can work with do this. not stand and do not shoot whatever you do. No stone unturned. That means the place is fully searched. Is that what I'm gathering from that? No stone unturned. Yep. Alright, let's drop this stuff off that we found. Including the... The that. Let's drop this. I'll have to call her and get more Plague Buster shit. But not using this dude. Let's get him more ammo. What is he using? 5.56 and 9? 45. 5.56. 45. Last mag in the piece. So if I'm right, that that is how the uh, the plague wall works, we'll have to get some explosives, like actual explosives, before we come back. Um, all right. For now, though, let's do this. Let's let's tell her go on. What can I do for you? Hang in there, okay? Don't get killed in the way. Let's be Keisha. What are you doing out here, Keisha? Where the hell are you? Oh my god. Here comes Helena creeping home. Please be safe. It's a long way. Alright, where the hell's my car at? Right there. I mean, she's, she's, she's creeping along, and I'm like running along behind her, like, I've got a care in the world. I left you some goodies. Don't everyone thank okay. me at once. Guess what we have to do? Hey, hey, just level up her wits. There's no point in taking stealth, is there? If, if stealth is, if everybody can creep as it is, is there? All right, fuck it, stealth. Find out. Maybe she creeps even faster now. Maybe. All right. Uh, we need to. Bloaters there. Do you mind helping us track down a few more plague bloaters? One moment. 
moment, please. This should help. Great. It's closer than I would like. Like closer to the downtown Marshall area that I don't want to be in. There goes Helena. <laughs> Hoping if I get away from her, she'll be safer. Here's a fucking feral, isn't that lovely? Right around where we gotta go. We just got word about a real good place to search for supplies. See, are we are we low on supplies? Is that what sponsors that? Here's the feral, like right beside me. And yet, I do have to go down there as far as I know. If I want these fucking bloaters. I just want to see if we are short on supplies. To better understand, yeah, it's probably for construction materials. We'll, uh, we'll go and get it in a minute if I survive this, this little bit. A lost and found. It's quiet time now. It hasn't noticed me. Let's keep it that way. Let's get this done with and get out of this area before it turns dark. Was it on the table? Is that still doable? Let's find out. Third. Still here, at least one. Let's clear out these goons who are going towards us here. Neither want nor need to be interrupted in the this. Where is it? It's like embedded in the geometry. <laughs> Use that. Kind of glad ammo's plentiful for this. Much more so than in a standard game. That's what I see. There was some other shit here I thought I saw. Is that Maybe it? I should no, look that's somewhere it. Else. Good tip. Right, that feral has not in any way noticed this, which is great. Let's go see who wants the supply run. Do I have to be Malik to do that? Maybe not. Maybe Malik's just recommending it. Let's go to the Santos Farmstead then. Um, let's go out this way. Stand how many cars there are here. Oh my god. It's no fun driving around here. Can 
you can radio her again and keep doing that, but let's do the supply run now because we do need construction materials in general. So let's get it done with. I just noticed. Um, in what do you call it? State of Decay 1, we built a. like a. an out. not an outpost, a. Th an observation post, a sniper tower for someone named Becca right in front of that building. That sniper tower is gone. It wasn't it? Didn't look all that sturdy. So maybe it makes total sense to dig it down. And I'm sure that not every player did that. Therefore, they couldn't leave it there in case you're like, "What the hell is this thing?" Just interesting to see what does and doesn't feel accurate to my previous playthrough. Can we go this way? Well, let's just take the damn road. I end up stuck somewhere and sad. Spencer's Mill. Cool little sign, never saw it before. I just looked at that guy and he fell over. It's like Keisha had horrible breath or something. How do we get in here? He's gonna hop this fence, but it's all barbed wire. Stealth, so we can definitely do this. Alright, let's make this place safe because it won't take long to do that. No one here but us, I guess. Sure glad these aren't completely gone. I'm sure there's more, but let's put this in the trunk. <laughs> Wish I'd parked closer now. <laughs> Whenever I used to go, uh, you know, when I was younger, you know, grocery shopping or something with my with my parents, they would, um, my dad especially would, would like circle the parking lot looking for the closest spot to the door, and I always thought, my God, no, fucking park unturned. anywhere will walk. But at this exact moment, a nice backpack. I thought that'd be more construction materials. Um, I kind of wish I'd parked closer. My father would have good instincts in the apocalypse. Alright, we got everything we wanted here. We're done. We gotta deliver this back. And if we don't do it fast, then it fails as a mission. So let's get this shit home. Even though that's ludicrous. Jesus, I hate this little car. <laughs> this thing spins out left and right. Alright. Ah.
I guess we're going cross country. I wasn't really thinking about it, but it looks like we are. This part's easy enough to traverse. I agree. Perfect parking job. All right, let's get some more of those plague busters built, and let's go search for more. Now that's gonna be handy. Let's go search for even more of them. Let's just radio her and get more of them. I don't want to um, go try and do that mission at night. Am I, why am I confused about everything in life? Hey Doc, you mind helping us track down a few more plague bloaters? Give me just a moment. Here's what my current intel has. Good luck. Way the fuck over there. Alright. I get more gas. I don't have any more. I had to pull it out. The stores here. Oh, where's our storage? Give me some gas cans. Only cost one for one, though. It's better than I've seen in the past. Let's just take the one. Once again, I'm going to suggest we stick to the road. I don't feel like cutting. Well, Christ, it is a long fucking way, isn't it? It's not... It's probably 35% longer this way and infinitely safer. Glad I found you guys. Thanks. I appreciate it. Everybody's having a fucking love fest back home. What the fuck? I went the wrong way. 
God damn it. Dag nabbit. Just thought of. This, um, screw you. This may, I, I commented in an earlier uh, episode that I thought, that I thought this map um, was actually the same size as the original State of Decay, two, State of Decay 1 map. And then I was just imagining State of Decay 1 to be bigger, but um, where's the section with the uh, fairground and the military outpost? I think actually that uh, this map does cut off a section of the old uh, State of Decay 1 map. It must be that the State of Decay 2 system is designed to handle smaller maps to begin with. They had to make a choice. Do we push everything closer together or do we cut off a section? They probably made the right choice. Well, I guess it's time to look around. Not a peep. I guess so. There's somebody up on that cliff, too. Oops, get down, girl. Looks like a plague bloater. See if my light floods through the entire wall here, or if it's like a double slit experiment and we get an interference pattern on the other side. Oh, it floods right there. <laughs> Alright, let's get this guy. Well, there's two of them. That one's gone, we lost it. And we gotta wait it out. There's a lot of guys up there, yeah, it's kind of creepy. Staring at my car. So searching here while we wait for that to dissipate. Now that's what I call loot. Rifle ammo press, that's pretty that fucking good. Much to carry. Another eight point backpack, that's good. I don't know if our I don't know if our bomb making region in our base qualifies as our workshop. Like do we have to build a separate workshop? I'd like to use that rifle ammo press, but I can't if uh I guess I could take in and out our ability to make plague busters. Play doh plague making kit, it. whatever it's called. It's also creepy. <clears throat> yeah, let's not squander the other two in here. Gotta do this quick. I think there's another one yet. I'm not hearing it. I'd be upstairs. I can't picture a plague bloater climbing in the first place, so maybe not, but in terms of the way the game Looks works, like maybe I spawned it upstairs. Well, this is the place the dock was holed up before. Realize that. Fuck. Alright. It's kind of ironic. She lived here and she's like, yeah, I found some there in my former living room. I called her to see where they were. This might be it. It might not. Well, it says there's still more to search. Here we go. <clears throat> Let's search that campsite while we're here, too. Up top. We have no pressing concerns, and it'll be goading us on to do a mission.
come. Let's get him before he yells. How is that place still so lit up down below? Is there a... Is it my car? My car is floodlight. My, my, my headlights are fucking powerful. Wow. Alright, um... You know what? There's a military outpost here. Let's go check it out on the way home. Just waiting really for that, um... That call me to find more... Plague Bloaters mission to come back, or that radio command to come back. Oh, fuck. Wanted to go over here. Can we make it and not get attacked by this fucking bloater? Is it possible? Or the uh, juggernaut? Let's run inside. I don't even know where to look first. It's still out there. The question is, is it really coming? It's also a horde to my left, so let's try and be a little quiet. It's coming right in. Maybe it'll just go as far as the car. Heavy duty ammo press me 50 caliber rounds, scary. man. If we did that, we could take down those plague, plague balls in a heartbeat. Attracting the horde as well. Lovely. I can't tell if they're beyond the walls or not. They are. If we're quiet, we should still be able to search. I'll take another 50, thank you. I need this shit. Let's, um... Let's use these, even though we barely need them. We actually need sandwiches. Drop this, obviously. Take the 50 caliber rounds, for fuck's sake, yes. I wish she didn't have a pistol, so I could give her this one. For now, drop this in favor of the thermite grenades, which will chuck at the damn plague walls. It's identical. It's just, no, it's maybe it's not. What do. It's quieter, less power. Huh. I'll come back for it. There it is, by the way. Get out of here. We know where this place is. We'll come back. On another day. Or we could just go to um, here. Get a more convenient place to drop everything off and come back. If that bomb making thing is not our uh, munition or our, our workshop, then I'll build a workshop, stick the uh, heavy duty ammo present, and build a ton of 50 cal rounds, and then we'll come back and. 
chuck the plague busters and just shoot the fucking wall apart. Yeah, sure, let's go this way. It seems to me that when the doc contacted us originally to tell us about the right plague walls. Yet. I hear someone who needs a helping hand. Deal with this. When she first contacted us, she may have explained how those plague busters worked. And I think I was in the middle of combat, so I didn't really absorb it. I remember commenting on that at the time. Oh, fuck me. Really? I'm out of gas. Yeah, I guess so. Let's take the, uh, the energy drink. Power us up for this fight. Oh, she's got a crossbow she's firing. Bring them back to her so she can help us. Hang in there. I think she had a crossbow. I, I thought I saw a crossbow barrel. fly by. Oh, for fuck, really? This fucking dynamite. There's a, um, oh fuck, there it is. There's a, um, blow that we can harvest if we don't pop it beforehand. Fuck, I gotta get down there and help her. Oh, fuck it. There's a screen there, too. Fuck you. Survivor. Actually, the achievement is just recruit eight people. Is that even Is this her again? Yeah, it's her again. What do you Diana. Want from me? Thank you. I didn't expect that. You risked your life because you want to be friends or something? <laughs> right on. Yes. It'd be Can nice you come to live, live with me? Where I could believe that. This is gonna come on. I'm like, mm. all right. Second contact. Yeah, she's gonna be a an ally, I think. Can we drop something and still get this plague boater? Blooder is here. Let's not miss the opportunity. Let's drop the damned. The damned to these things. Try and get it. Careful. Careful. <clears throat> Probably get gas out of one of these, but I'm I'm loaded up. Let's just go. Probably get a rucksack, I mean, but let's just go. Where the fuck did I park? Would have made total sense to me if the uh, if the town had looked like this in State of Decay One. It's just so bizarre that it's so littered with vehicles now, and it wasn't then.
Once again, I parked far away. Darn it. Let's swap it. Put this thing on the scar. It is a scar, isn't it? Yeah. Let's see if we can build a... Oh, wait. I thought I saw somebody who was plagued up, but they're not. This is a basic lab. We don't have a workshop, per se. Do we? Is this a workshop? Can we put the... Um... Yes, we can. Heavy duty ammo press, damn straight. All right. We won't build anything else right now. We're pretty low on materials. Um, did I get rid of everything? I think I did. I think I'm carrying. I like this feature that lets you leave your headlights on. That's pretty cool. That's pretty heavy. Nice uh, place to search right there for weapons and shit, actually. Check there in a second. I should probably swap her out, too. I just realized how hurt she is. Let's give the girl a break. Give me someone else. I'll do a little more searching. Oh, with, why do I have a headless community? Did the game freeze again? I don't know, Undead Labs. You have a few problems with your Heartland scenario here. I think it froze again. I'm going to guess. I'm going to try and get out right now. Um, 